My name is Patty and welcome to my YouTube channel. I tend to post videos on cleaning, home decor, and life as a working mama. And today's video is going to be my winter growth collaborative haul. I say winter because I picked up, I think, all of the Mrs. Meyer seasonal scents for winter. And I'm actually pretty excited about it because, of course, I had to sniff some beforehand. And today I have a special guest, Loki, with me. Because she's freaky! Yeah. yeah! So, let me get into this box. This Look. little chick always getting into all of it. And go through the dish so faster. I could be completely making this up, but that's just how I feel. I was like, I am not gonna like that long term. It's like, ooh, ooh, new set, new set. This is a freaking cult. setup going on right now because I'm in between I just took all of my Halloween decorations down and if you watch that like Halloween and decorate with me I had no idea what to do with this space but I am going to be filming this weekend in this room at least all of like my Christmas stuff in here like my white winter wonderland so it's gonna change anyway so just bear with me and just bear with me low because I haven't filmed with her in a very long time besides vlogs <laughs> Okay. Okay. So, I have a decently sized box here, and I'm going to go through everything one by one. So I put on Sophia for low, so hopefully she stays in there and is quiet so I can get this filmed. Hopefully. But anyways, let me start. So I first picked up this coconut scrubber sponge. I really like these and I think they do a great job at like taking the food off the scrubber side and it's like not abrasive so I really enjoy that and it's weird. I feel like using natural sponges with natural dish soap helps the dish soap last longer. Like I feel like when I use my just like regular generic sponges with the natural dish soap, I go through the dish soap faster. I could be completely making this up but that's just how I feel. I also picked up this 100% organic unbleached cheesecloth. Now, I thought this would be a good idea to use when I'm like making my lemonade. So I just started making my own lemonade. It's super easy. It tastes delicious. And they just never seem to have the lemonade that I like in store anyways. Because I'm sure people just buy it because it's freaking delicious. <laughs> so I thought this would be good to use to like strain the like all like the pulp and the seeds so I maybe I'll get into making my own orange juice because I do like homemade orange juice not from the store though um so yeah I thought this would be good for that I'm not sure and I'll just see how it goes <laughs> but I was just randomly on there and you know when you're like clicking through things and you see it and you're like huh that's interesting maybe I'll check it out I'm going to show these three things together because they have on their website all these different cleaning tools and they have this one which is interchangeable so this is just what is it the universal wand and you can put like the different brush heads on so I got the bottle brush one because ours is kind of like old and gross so the one that we had the old one was back when Lo used to take bottles so that was a long time ago it needed to get thrown away so I picked up this head and then I also picked up this Champlain glass cleaner one. I thought this would be good to clean out all of my glass mason jars, like get to the bottom, like really scrub it out. Because sometimes there's like a film that gets stuck from when I make my own teas as well. <laughs> you know, a little Miss Homemade over here. I thought I would test those out. And I thought it was cool that there's like the interchangeable heads. And then you could just keep on purchasing new heads instead of like a whole new piece. Yeah, the rest of the stuff that is left is all Mrs. Meyer's stuff. So I'm just going to go through this one first because I don't believe it's part of the winter scents. I only saw it in the hand soap. So this is the plumberry scent and it actually smells pretty good. Yeah, I actually really like it. I still have some of the apple cider one left so um, I might just hold off on using this at first and maybe I'll finish some of that up but I'm not sure. So that was the only hand soap I got which if you're wondering like why didn't you get the hand soaps in the other scents? Because when I bought the mint one, the mint hand soap back for like spring, it smelled different than the regular cleaners and I didn't like it even though I was obsessed with the cleaner and I was afraid that was going to happen, especially with the, pimp the peppermint one. So I was like, maybe I won't get the hand soaps. Plus, like I said, I still had other hand soaps that I had to go through 
and I was like, well, I'm already testing out the scents in all the other products, so I don't need to get it in the hand soap as well. I'll just get this one since I figure I can't buy this in the other stuff. That was my little like rationale for that. The three winter scents they have on Grow are the Orange Clove, the Peppermint, and then the Iowa Pine. So I got all three scents in the dish soap because we don't have a dishwasher, so we kind of burn through dish soap, especially since these bottles are pretty small. I just figured I might as well get all three. I can test all three scents. Now I'm not big on orange. So the orange clove, this was the only thing I got it in. Now it does smell pretty good. It's like light on the orange, but it kind of has a little bit of spice, which I'm assuming is like the clove part, but it's not overly spicy. So I actually do like it. But like I said, I'm not into orange. So I was like, you know what? I'm not gonna get the other stuff in it, especially not the room spray. I was like, I am not gonna like that long term. And then the Iowa pine and the mint or the peppermint I got on the other stuff. And I actually really like the Iowa pine. So let me backtrack. You all know I hate Mrs. Meyer scents, mostly like their original scents I hate. And people go on and on and on about them. And I'm like, I don't know why they smell terrible, but I do like some of the seasonal scents. But I remember smelling these, like maybe it was a couple years ago. And I was like, these smell terrible. Like I do not like the winter scents. I was really contemplating not picking any of these up. I was like, maybe it's different, like maybe I'll just try it. So I don't know if it was when I was pregnant at the time, like maybe my scent has changed, but I actually really like this scent and I also like the peppermint as well. I'm so excited for this one. Like it smells so fresh because it kind of reminds me of the mint, but obviously it's, this is peppermint. So it's like cleaning with those peppermint candies, like which you would think is weird, but this smells so good, so freaking good. So I love all three of those. So like I said, I picked up both of the sprays and I was super excited because I was upset for fall. I didn't see a room spray for the apple cider scent. I actually didn't see a room spray for any of the fall scents. They only had the candles. So I thought, oh, they're probably just gonna have the candles again for winter, no they have the room sprays as well which how freaking awesome is this going to be well actually both of them for Christmas because it's like I don't buy real trees I have like four fake trees and this is going to make my house smell like I have a real tree oh it's great it's like the real tree without the pine needles although I mean fake trees fall apart this is going to oh my god this is going to be freaking awesome so yeah, they had they had it in the orange clove as well, but like I said, I don't really like orange scented things too much. I don't really like eating oranges too much either. So I was like, I am going to skip out on that. So I bought this. So I am super excited. That was all. I feel like I was supposed to get a free thing with my order, but I didn't see anything, so I don't know. I feel like it was a kind of small order, but I am super excited to be using these in all of my Christmas videos like I'm so excited for Christmas I have all like I have a lot of my Christmas videos planned out but I keep on seeing everybody posting all of like their like Christmas decor and I'm like did I plan it too late so I might actually be moving some of those videos up especially the one haul because I was like um I don't think they're going to be able to find these anymore and I am so obsessed with some of the items I picked up so I might be moving those videos up, so you'll just have to make sure to have those bell notifications on so you don't miss out on that. And would you like me to do some fun holiday-inspired cleaning videos? Like, is that would that be fun? I know you guys like to make spooky clean with me, so maybe I'll try to think of some kind of holiday one as well. I'm not going to spoil it for you. But yeah, I really hope you enjoy, and I hope you look forward to some of my cleaning videos using these products. Like, I feel like I have converted into a Mrs. Myers lover. Like, I swear, I told someone else, like, I swear, it's like a freaking cult. Like, at first, you're just like, oh, I don't know if I really like these scents, but ooh, like, they have a limited edition scent. Like, let me test this out for the season. Oh, my God, this smells so good. I wonder what else. You start going into the other different products, and then, oh, every new season, there's a new scent, and you're just like, ooh, ooh, new scent, new scent. Like, it's a freaking cult. It is definitely a cult. 
Now, I do want to say too, I was watching Amy Fritz's video the other day. She was doing, was it her clean with me? Her like Christmas decorate with me or something. And she had this other set, I forget now what it was called, and it was blue, but you can get it at Target. I'll like insert a picture of it. And I really want to know how that smells. Like, let me know if you can pick it up elsewhere. Like, because it didn't say that it was exclusive to Target, but I was surprised I didn't see it on Grove. So let me know what you think of that scent down in the comments. Like, should I pick that one up as well? Like, am I going a little overboard? Do I have too many cleaning products? Like, should I do like a video showing you all my cleaning products? Like, that might actually be embarrassing because I think I have way too many. But I just love testing them out and trying them out for you guys. So, um, yeah, I think I rambled along a little too much, like I always do in all of my videos. <laughs> I'm just a talker. So, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for sticking around to the end. And thanks again for watching. Bye.